Hey folks, Whip here, and welcome on back to the Empire's SMP for episode number three, where my friends, a few things have changed. We've had a few visitors around here. They've been pleasant. Hospitality around this place is so amazing. I don't know what it is. I just love this pillar. It's a nice pillar, isn't it, guys? Isn't it? These are my new friends over here. This is Gerald and uh, Hank, and uh, Pixar now has a new best friend, like me and my two best friends over here. Do you also want to be my best friend? Make sure to subscribe and leave a like down below. The plan today, my friends, is to get the villagers out of the basement and give them an actual place to run around. No more cramped villagers down there. We're not inhumane around here or anything. No, not at all. Nope, he just didn't bring small Dripley. He didn't heed the warning sign, that's all I'm saying. But I would love to create a small hamlet or village around this area where we can let our villagers roam and free around this entire place so they can really have their nice little hospital areas where they can hang out, do all their best stuff over there. I think it's gonna be absolutely amazing. Now, before we dive into the building, I really wanna make sure we can get some villager trading set up, and I think a pumpkin and melon farm is gonna be our best bet in order to get a lot of emeralds, because, well, we've got a lot of pumpkins and melons right now, and we can easily make that farm now that we went to the nether in the last episode, so we've got all the quartz we could ever need. I've been doing a little bit of enchanting as well around here, and check out these enchants on the gear. The only bad one's really the protection two right there, but we've got a lot of really good stuff going. And this super pickaxe here, which is amazing. But I'm gonna spend a little bit of time over here working through the crop fields, seeing what I can get gathered up so that when we do start training with the farmer villagers, we can very quickly get them all the way upgraded in order to be at that pumpkin and melon trading level because we need a lot of potatoes and carrots to get them there. Hello? 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 Oh, uh, uh, hi. Uh, oh, hello. Hi. Uh, <laughs> hi. Nice choice of outfit over here, I see. Nice choice Thank of outfit. You. Yeah, I mean, it, it kind of goes with the territory. I'm, I'm here to trade. Um, from what I can tell, my kind isn't super welcome here. Yeah, but... do you do you have any small drip leaf on you? <laughs> Sadly, no. Have you found a wandering trader with small drip leaf yet? By the way, because I'm having the hardest time. No, that that's 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 yeah, here here. I'll I'll show you. I'll yeah, just you know maybe maybe you just picked up the cloak on your way over here, acquired it from somebody. But you might want to come look at this. Yeah, I I can kind of see from a distance that uh, you're you're getting quite the collection here, my dude. This is, yeah, it's just. Slightly worrying. They're my friends. They're all, they're 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 all my friends. They're, they're my <laughs> I'm, nice I'm friends. Glad. Yes, I'm. Uh, hopefully, everything stays friendly here. But so thank this you. This is Gerald. I, 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 really Gerald and I outside. talk a lot. We we hang out. We really like looking at the redstone up here on the wall. Is yes. It, isn't it nice? Isn't it nice to just stare at? Do you want to just sit here and stare with me? Um, I I'm good. Shh, but shh, 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 shh. sorry, you were saying. Okay, um, I, <laughs> I actually have um, some, some more of that for you, since you seem you to do. be so, so fascinated by it. Yeah, yes, um, yes. So, mm -hmm. so, the, so the Wandering Trader has actually brought something useful. Uh, in the, the, the contents of my llama, which apparently I have to get on to access his inventory, it's a very Ooh. weird system. Uh, I, I, have, I, have, I have a little bit of this. Oh, inspecting it, inspecting it. Looks, yep, looks premium quality. Looks great Good. for staring at. I, I do, you, yep, inspecting you, you obviously have an eye for that kind of thing. Oh, um, yeah. No, so... I'm very, very good at inspecting these things. And I, <laughs> I can tell it's authentic when I see it right from here. Just, yep. I have half a stack of this stuff. And uh, I don't know exactly what you're going to do with it. Uh, but whatever yeah, it's, it is, it's, 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 it, it, just, you just, it look. Seems, just look. It seems vaguely nefarious. No, 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 no. We're, you know this, the land around here? Do you see how lush this is? Do you see how lush this is around here? It's just mm, so much life coming in everywhere. Gerald agrees. And uh, there's there's something in your hand that I'm I yeah I, a, I, a, I, a yep. little bit drawn to. Um, mm -hmm. <laughs> so so I feel like we could probably work out a deal. Uh, how much of that do you have? I ha I have four. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well that's that's actually perfect because like deep slate redstone is kind of everywhere. I'm kind of willing to part with all of my deep slate redstone if you want to give me all four of your emerald ore. I, I can make that trade. That sounds like a great trade to me. We can do that. This <laughs> is of no use to me. I can just, yeah, there you go. It's all you, man. All you. Thank you. Thank you so, so much. Uh, <laughs> that is legitimately the first emerald ore that I've got on the server so far. So you are, <laughs> you, you're, you're starting something terrible and it goes beyond any of this. You don't, you don't know, you don't know what has begun, but uh, I mean, nice place you got here. This is my first time actually seeing it. Do you want to? Oh yeah. Yeah. Welcome. 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 We have, we have a lot of great friends around here. It's a big, happy family. Me and the, the three doggos over here. We're chilling. We really, really love it. You know, next time oh, if you come back, uh, just remember the 
<laughs> yeah, I, mean, I was. I was saying. You, you actually have dogs up there. I was. I thought you were talking about the three heads outside. Of no, your yeah, apartment. no, uh, yeah. It's I and I chat all the time. He really, really, yeah. He talks about he's this a, dog named Bubbles a lot. I, I don't know. We have great conversations. Talk, he's though. a talkative guy, so yeah, I can mm -hmm. see how that works out for you. But um, yeah, no, lovely. I, I can't wait to see what you do with the rest of the place because oh, yeah, uh, I'm sure it. Thank you. big Thank plans you. for the area. I, I guess if you want more friends, I can be on the lookout for those for you as well. Oh yeah, no, I'll always accept more friends around here. Yep, Re friends and uh, more of this stuff. That sounds great. And small drip leaf, very small, small drip leaf. Yep. Okay, mm -hmm. cool. I will. Uh, I will go look for small drip leaf, and uh, if you if you ever see me again, I will try and have some. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Well, you have a great time now. You have a great time. Come back anytime you have small drip leaf or redstone ore. I've got a brand new friend out here, everybody. Look at my new little llama boy. He's chilling out over here, looking out over the Wheat River and all of our sugar cane, but he's just hanging. But next up on the list of things I want to do today is we got to move forward on that villager stuff like I was talking about, and I wanted to build up a pumpkin melon farm. I believe I mentioned that one earlier, but check how much iron we have now over here. I did a mining adventure on stream, and holy cow, we got that, and we got a lot more even smelting down in there. But next up, I need to craft up a lot of observers for ourselves, so we might be a little shy on cobblestone here. I don't know. We got to go to Mount. Now, the design I always use for this one is going to be the Ill Mango Pumpkin and Melon Farm because it is just too good to pass up. So we got the observers handled there with 40 of them. And then coming up here, I need to take a little bit of wood out of this guy. And we've got all of the pistons we need. Okay, I believe I've got all the resources ready to go here in my inventory to at least get the base farm built up. I'm still going to have to come back in and get the collection system and all that sorted over here. But I had a thought, my friends, as I've been talking about expanding the villagers out and letting them run around wherever the heck they want. And ooh, that mountain is looking fantastic over there. Doesn't it kind of look like a tooth? A little bit like a big old tooth. Maybe we can go off of that for something over there. But anyways, I'm thinking we use the top of this hill and turn it into a little bit of a hamlet around here. Have five or six buildings inside of it. Have our villagers running around like crazy idiots inside like they will always do. And I think it's going to be absolutely amazing. Except let's raise ourselves up another three or four blocks so we get a little bit more height variation around here. So without any further ado, my friends, I'm going to get the first building built up over here. So let's get on with it with good old fashioned time lapse mode. Oh man, I love having Zoom back. Just a little bit more dirt that needs to be placed around up here and we'll have the top of our floating hillside for now, but I really love the new building that we have. I think this thing has worked out very, very well. The pumpkin and melon farm has grown up, so we're starting to get a little bit of production on that round. And then up here, I want to show you all the backside of it because I know we didn't capture that too well in the time lapse over here. But it is looking super sweet as well. So we got this all back here. I've kind of left the bottom area a little bit more on the blank for now because I'm not sure what I want to do with it quite yet. So we'll figure that out as we get rocking. I can't believe I forgot this, my friends. But while I was building this thing over here, and I'm just going to spend a little bit of time getting some more of this dirt placed down so we have a larger platform and can eventually get our villagers from there all the way to up here. So I need to get a tunnel rocking for them too. But I forgot that I met up with Gemini today way earlier in the day, way before even starting to record this episode here really for everything happening today. And we tackled that double skeleton spawner. So let's go ahead and jump on over there and uh, see how all those shenanigans happened. That double skeleton spawner finally. So, hey, look, we got an experience rhyme. Let's get over to that. Hello, Flip. Hey, Jem, how you doing? Good. To look at you. Look, you're all shiny over there. Look at you. You are shiny too. You have blue armor on. I, I do. I got some nice shiny boots, and uh, that's about oh my it. That's goodness. Well, I'm shiny, but not nearly as impressive as you. I, I just have iron. <laughs> I I found a double skeleton spawner, and you want? I I heard you're in the need of some experience and uh, potentially some bones and everything. Uh, would you be interested in I, helping me set oh. it up? Yes, yes, I would love to. I love bones, and 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 I can help you, and and then we can both benefit. It'll it'll be great. Sounds also, cool. I brought you a gift. <gasps> what is that? Oh my gosh! Thank you. Do you see how I many I put into this dang thing over here? I have to build like I do. I don't it's even beautiful. Flip. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's shiny and glowy, and there's little red bits in it, and yeah. I love it. So, anyways, off this way, it's a little bit of a travel distance, but it is right over here. Okay. If I can sure. remember where it is. 
Definitely. Definitely well, can. You can. I. I hope so. Flip, you described this as close to both of us. Yeah, it's it's for close. We're the closest people to it in the I, whole world. Mm, mm -hmm. Okay, it's fair. It's not technically a lie, but it's technically the truth, the best kind of truth, right? I, yeah. Right. <laughs> Just you it's know, fine. my legs are getting tired. Almost there. Yep, we're about uh halfway. <laughs> we do it halfway. <laughs> It's gonna be pretty nice. That's fair enough. Fair enough. Go for a nice swim, rest your legs, use your arms. It'll be, yeah, just float right across the river and then we're almost there. Are we there yet? Nope, nope. We're almost almost there. Almost there. Trust me. It's just, you see these trees right, right over the trees. I swear, it's right there. Sure, we're not there yet. Oh, no, no, we're almost there. It's See, th those trees right up there? I told you. Right at, right at the next set of trees. Next set of trees. Yep. That see, worked. now we're across the mountain and uh, the next set of trees. We're in... We're in... No, no. This is the set. The... Nope, what? next set of trees. Next set of trees. I think it's... Uh... Yeah, what it's right... It's right... No, 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 it's right here. Right, It's this way, right here. See, oh. told you. We're right here. See? Oh, my goodness. I told you. See, <laughs> just one and then just follow one. right down here. Just you might hit your head a few times, but it's fine. It's fine. See? I have several. Look Whoa. at this. And look it up They're there. so close. I know. And I've already tested. If you stand in the middle right up here, you can get both of them. So it will okay. actually work. It's not a lost cause. So uh, I found the thing. I have no idea what we do. Do you know what we do? We we uh, we make it work so that we can get XP. We, right. We funnel, okay. yep. we funnel these bad guys into a tunnel. That leads somewhere the where we can stand in the middle, okay. and then we can hit them from where we funnel them. Okay, okay, gotcha, gotcha. That's all we have to do, really? Wait, okay, so you're saying they'll merge <laughs> together on the up, but at different Yeah, levels? so like one is coming across at like that layer right here, the other one's coming across at like this layer right here, and then the drop and then shoot they go is up like together, in this- Or they go they, down together? They would drop down together. Or we could have them going up at different layers. They can that go could up work. Together too, I think. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's. Well, let's do that. That'll be simpler. That's the only way that I can wrap my mind around it. I'm yeah. Having no, a let's brain do that. moment. <laughs> <laughs> when two builders try and do something technical, that's that's what's We're happening both like, here. Uh... I think I could do it. What if in the center was the tube going up, and you can see them through tinted glass going up, and then they drop down on a side? So we have this one like coming up right here. I like, wouldn't that be bring cool myself to touch. Can we up? get this back with? I just think that would be really pretty. Uh, oh, it totally. Add anything, but no. Oh, I <laughs> just fell back down. Yeah. So we have have the one water chamber going right here, going straight up to the top. I'm thinking. I think that we. <laughs> I think that we do the thing that you said first. We're not. They're not joining on the up. They're joining on the down. Yeah. So take this that makes guy. more sense now that I've had as a moment to brain. That is perfect, Flip. Perfect. You okay. Nailed it. Here. Uh, do you have inventory space to throw a soul sand down at the bottom just so we can mark yeah. it? Have one. You might you might oh need to clear <laughs> Yeah, I just <laughs> throwing it down there for you. You're good to go. <laughs> you literally straight delivered it. This is so fun. I love doing stuff like this. I haven't built a farm with somebody in ages. <laughs> I'm just like I'm just mentally. I'm standing here waiting like... for you to pour water on me and I'm like, yes. I'm ready. Do it. Do it. <laughs> I'm just trying to start this tunnel over here. Uh, 195 for the Z. And then 138. Oh, yep. <gasps> yep. Yep. That. Okay. <laughs> I got the right tunnel. Oh. Hey, do you, you know it. if you drop from that height, you end up on half a heart? <laughs> so if I punch you right now. Yeah, please theory. don't. I don't. I didn't. Yep. <laughs> no, that's okay. Now, yeah. <laughs> okay. <gasps> it's working. They're going up. <laughs> oh, they are awesome. <laughs> so cool. And this one's activated too. Oh, they don't. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. What are you? Are you okay? Oh no. Okay? Yep. Totally fine. Totally fine. Yep. Fine oh and dandy. God. Cool. I hear it happy works. experience sounds. Yeah. Great. It appears we have a working skeleton farm. I I think we do. I still have yet to see one actually come up through this tube, but I think I've just been blind and missed them. But it it I saw it, one. Does, it does it does do definitely things. happens. If this was just like a few blocks, you know, to here, just like two blocks back this. Oh, oh look, I just one saw just one go up. through. Oh, 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 oh. It's kind of cool though, right? It's very cool. I'll take it. 
<laughs> oh, this is fantastic. I am all here for this. Why is there a random thing of water coming out of the ground behind it? Nobody knows, <laughs> but it's fine. Nobody knows. Woo. Nice shack. Look yeah, seems that. great. Look at it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Ooh. It's like an outhouse, but like... But like... Not. You, you drop down instead of dropping other things down. Yeah. Yeah. Well, awesome. I think here's your, here's the rest of your kelp back. You know, I'll let you hold on to that one. Almost level. I need I need two more levels. And I'll be level thirty. Yeah. No, you keep so you just keep swinging the sword. So it's great. Close. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. At the skeletons. At, at, oh, okay. At at skeletons. At 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 the <laughs> skeletons. Okay. It's working so well, Flip. We did it. Oh, this is gonna be great. This is gonna be great, Jim. We've done it. We've we've solved we our experience it. problems. We can now sit I'm here. I'm so proud of us. Well, thank you so very much for coming over and helping out with this. I really do appreciate it. Uh, thank this you would for have taken me. forever to do by myself. So yeah, I know. Without me here bugging you and yeah, definitely. You as uh -huh. you fall, gravel falls. Um. Well, very cool. Uh, we can figure out later if we want to let anybody else in on this one, I guess, and see where it goes from there. But thank you so definitely. very much for helping. I really appreciate it. Yeah, thank you for the invite. Right, okay. Enjoy the walk home. <laughs> Welcome back to present day, where I got left on red. But that's fine, because I've been doing a lot of digging and a lot of terraforming. My friends, over here, we've got the new house set up with actually some decent amount of space above it. That's a creeper, okay? Don't panic. Don't panic. Don't panic. We can respawn in this world. That's fine. Oh, we can two shot him now. I'll take it. Nice. And while I've been building, I don't know what's happened here, but this area is permanently dark. As far as I know, nobody's placed any blocks all the way up there, but we just have this permanent dark spawnable area where the light is at level zero. So maybe we'll build that into our lore and hope it, it hopefully Hopefully it doesn't disappear. But you might have noticed a little bit of a tube coming from underground all the way down here where I've been doing the digging. I've dug out an entire tunnel to bring villagers all the way to right here so that we can send them off upwards into the city. Unfortunately, did not have enough kelp to get it all the way up. So just need to bone meal a few more times and that should be good. We've got a bed on the far side. So the villagers are gonna try and walk through here like this and then they're gonna get caught like me and sent all the way up into the village where I wanna bring a bunch of fences for now and just block off a section right here so that they cannot get out, but they're gonna be able to get into this section at the tippity top where I've got a lot of composters for us and this is gonna be where all of our farmer villagers are going to be hanging out. So I wanna spend a little bit of time trying to get those dudes up here and we can have our first friends inside of our village. First and foremost, eh, fence time. Our makeshift fence is in place up there and I've gotta run around now and gather up a little bit more wool. Unfortunately, I think I've killed all the sheep in the area but uh, we've got to make it so that we can build a few beds in there so they actually have a place to hang out when the night falls. Beds and everything have been acquired and I do hope this thing is actually gonna work properly here. So if we run all the way down here, I know for now we're not gonna be zombie curifying all these villagers because we don't have the ability to yet. Haven't got the blaze rods or anything to make the potions quite yet. So that did not work. Uh, no, 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 get it, oh, nailed it. Take two, let's try that one right there. Perfect, there he goes. And he is off around the corner. And perfect, I left the last powered rail here turned off, which we can turn on right like that and that would knock them downwards. And my thought is that if we were able to turn that off, basically we can hook the zombie killing chamber right up here, a curifying chamber right here before we send them into the village. But these guys, let's be honest, they're probably gonna die. So uh, you wanna go in? Look, your bed's over there. No, no, a nice bed is right right over there through the water. Right there, through the water. Right there. Yeah, right there, first villager's going up. Let's go with him. Up this way, buddy, up this way. We've got beds, we've got everything you could possibly need. So we're just gonna, it's just gonna be a temporary setup for now, everybody. We'll figure out the interior later. Yep, just, yep, we're doing great. You're doing a great job, buddy. Come on, I, I wanna give you a home to hang out in all the way up here. I don't see any issues with uh, bulk sending the villagers over for now, so let's just see how they go. They'll all end up somewhere nearby, and now we'll gather the minecarts and bring them back. Oh, that was all of them I have. Okay, gotta turn the breeder back on. Go to your brand new home, everybody. Up, up, and away. It's gonna be amazing. No, 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 no. Not amazing. Not amazing. No, no. Why are you trying to go that way? You're gonna get in the minecart. The minecart's gonna catch you. No, it's not. He's he's a professional. Get in the minecart, please. Thank you. Okay, issue sorted. No, new issue, new issue. No, it's down, down. Just, just go down, please. Okay, there we go, everybody. We've done it. Everybody through. Go up into the city. It's gonna be lovely. 
They love it. They're, they're, they all love it. They're all, oh, you seem, you're like, oh my God, I smell a composter, a composter. Oh, up into the tower we go, up into the building. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's going to be amazing. Okay, now we're inside. Hello, 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 hello. This is going to be fantastic. How we doing, Mr. Farmer Boy? Ooh, you're over here. We got the wheat trades. We've got this guy with the carrot potato trades. Oh, it's good. So good. Let me go get some and we can have our first trades. I can't believe we have our first loyal subjects of the empire hanging out right there. Look at him. I even build him a hot tub, everybody. What more could they want? We have a dark evil pig. Come on. You can you can figure this out. I believe in you. I, come on, buddy. Just didn't you wait. Yeah, there you go. You found your way inside. Good job. Well done. All right. What would you like to trade? Pumpkins or potatoes? Let's see if we can get the pumpkins next, though. You're looking for wheat. Okay. Wheat we can do. You want wheat as well. Well, well, boys. Over here, we've already got pumpkins. That's amazing. Here, we've got pumpkins too. And no three pumpkin. You have one job. One job to trade pumpkins. That's all. That's all I wanted. Got the carrot potato dude leveled up again though. So that's gonna be amazing. We need some names for these ones. Look how amazing they are though. <gasps> discounted pumpkins. And melons, discounted melons. Oh, amazing, amazing, amazing. The farm has been running the entire time and I have not really checked it at all. So let's see how many we got now. Not many. Not, not many. Okay. Well, you know what? We'll keep working with them soon and hopefully the one will go to the hot tub soon. The next plan here, everybody, is I think uh, we're in need of some mending. We've got these tools that are starting to be broken down. A lot of these ones, mostly I just want to own that and the boots and the helmet for now because those are the only things I'm really going to be keeping. But somebody has already acquired mending here and we just came into a stack and a half almost of emeralds. So I think it's time for a uh, little sneaky mission over to this guy's place. First off, we're going to need to make up a bunch of books right there, but 10 should do it. I don't think I'll be able to afford 10 mending books with this unless he's already zombie purifying them and everything. But uh, we'll see. I'm just going to go on a little bit of a sneaky mission now. It's totally fine. It's fine. Not an act of aggression at all. Just going to uh, trade some books for some emeralds and we'll be back. And I... <laughs> <laughs> I've fallen in this dang hole <laughs> so many times. That's not at all foreshadowing of the adventure to come right now. No, of course not. We've just now reached the Dark Oak Forest. The sun is setting, so we're taking ourselves in under the shroud of darkness here unless somebody else decides to sleep on the server, but it's going to be a stealthy mission. I'm really hoping we don't get caught. We'll see what happens, though. <laughs> There it is, my friends. There is House Sausage right over there. We need to be getting apparently into the upgraded jail of that building right in there. So we've got a little bit of a walk. Let's go through the trees and see if we can't slide our way around. It begins. He's an archer. Oh, God. No, what? Oh, that we might be here at a bad time, everybody. We might be here at a really bad time. I didn't kill any of those villagers. What is going on? What's what's uh, going on over here? Um, how you doing? Don't, Good to see you. Don't, don't don't look, don't look. This is just an accident, an unforeseen accident. I am better uh, than this. Oh, what have you done? Um, the thing is, um, I didn't come I, over here for any reasons at all. No. No. Um. Wait, wait. Give it a few minutes, and you're gonna get the best discounts of your life. Oh, oh, very nice, very nice. Well, you know, I definitely came over here for a, a trade adventure. That's what it was. So. Um, oh. Yeah, here's the first uh, organically raised gunpowder of my lands. Oh, wow, that is beautiful. <laughs> it tastes nice. Oh, this so, is so good. Um, yeah. Do you have to have the m mending villager, or is he one of these? <laughs> yeah, um, the thing is, um, one of these guys is mending, okay? Um, I'm not sure which one yet until they're cured. Uh, but uh, hopefully... What about this guy? Oh, you got a third one over here. Yeah, and there's one over here, too. I kind of have to separate it just in case if one got cured before the other one, and then the other one ate the other one while the other one was being cured. So, so what happened to the like, babies, oh, huh? Did they, they didn't make it? I have no idea, to be honest. And at the same time, I don't even know if these are the good villagers yet because there were six of them. Uh, well, I, I uh, them it seems them. like I came over at a great time. You know, I can just yeah. stand guard out here. Definitely wasn't trying to sneak around or anything. Yeah, no, I'm just... No. You're, Here to you're do fine. a little shopping. That's that was all. Yeah, I'm just I'm just gonna make sure everything turns out okay. Uh, hopefully, one of these uh, or all of these are the ones that they're supposed to be, and they're not the ones that I. Uh... Yeah, that would be. Yes. Hey, one cured. Look at that. Wow, fantastic. Where oh, it's he? this guy. Who is this he? is your Who is fortune he? three guy. He oh, didn't get... thank oh, he God. you get the discounts. That's right. I forgot about that. This is mending. Guess oh. what? One emerald. So, uh, you want to do some trades for me? You know, I'll yeah. help you. I'll give you the supplies. You can help level them up. I got emeralds. I got books. 
Okay, give it, give, give it to me, and uh, we'll we'll help each other out. This is fantastic. There you oh. go. There's four. Okay, how many mendings you need? Uh, as many as I can get. Honestly, I'll start with four, but I'll take as many as I can get. Bam. Is he still unlocked? He is. Yep. <laughs> I need emeralds, though. I'm poor. Oh, dude, oh, I got, is. dude, I got a pumpkin and melon farm set up. I got so many emeralds. Oh, I can't believe how cheap this is. I'm so happy that I'm, I totally did this on purpose. That's right. Wait, wait, those books, the books. Oh, this guy's not ready yet. Hold on. This guy's not ready yet. Oh. So, uh, do you, do you pick up those extra mending books that you just, you trade for? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. I got four. Great. Yeah, can I, can I, can I, can I, can I, can I get? Can I yeah, how many you need? How many you need? I did, I, I did on all four of them, man. Oh. G give, give me some emeralds. They're, they're like one a piece. Here, you know what? Here, I'll give you a tip. I'll give you a tip. Yeah. We can double the amount of emeralds that uh, you can also have eight emeralds there too. So you can get eight of your own. Oh, that's exactly okay. Perfect. I got books. I'm fine. I got books. Oh, come here. Well, fine. you have a nice day now, sir. Oh, Definitely. Oh, yep. Thank have you. a fantastic day. I appreciate doing business with you. Yep. Thank, okay. Thank run you. away. Run thank away. Run away. What? What? Is that it? You know what? I think that turned out better than it ever could have. I'll take that. That's a big win. Well, I got completely lost in the jungle. I managed to find my way back over here. Huh. This is, pr as far as I know, I'm directly that way, and I've been walking from right there. So this might be exactly in the middle between Sausage and I. Eventually, the plan, by the way, my friends, is to completely transform Spawn and grow it into its own little, like, palace structure. Home sweet home of our nice, lovely red rock pillar sticking up out of the ground, and I love this new building we have. Oh, the skyline is going to look so amazing as soon as we have it, all of the buildings on top of a hill right across there. Oh, it's going to be so good. I'm so excited. I'm not sure where I want to throw all the mending books besides the pickaxe that I'm currently holding because it's kind of a top tier pickaxe and I don't want to be losing it. So we're going to run in here and I think the mending books, we will just throw them all inside this with those guys. Let's take one of these, sleep in our amazing bed and 17 levels to add mending to that pickaxe. It's going to be worth it. We just got to run over to the skeleton spawner and get a bunch of levels and repair this thing. It'll be great. Don't you think there is the llama boy? Yeah, I agree. We may to accomplish so much today folks oh my gosh isn't it absolutely wonderful oh this is gonna be so much fun i'm having an absolute blast here on the series my friends so please be sure to click that like button down below if you did enjoy but that is gonna have to do it today my friends so be sure to subscribe if you are brand new and enjoying what we got going here on empires as well and there's our parrot look at him he's adorable but without any further ado my friends i will catch you on the flip side